Hello my dear family members, today is the time to check if you are ready to sit for Accenture exam or not. Actually, now I am going to share all the coding questions which were asked on 24th November 2023. But I will not give you the solution. Just I will tell you how to solve, right? By the way, first question is regarding pattern based and the second question is based on generic concept. So let's see what are the questions asked on 24th November. So the first question is regarding Floyd's triangle. So you have to print Floyd's triangle, right? So actually the input format is the first line contains an integer which represents the number of lines you have to print, right? And output should be like this, okay? It can be number or it can be stars, right? Okay, so I hope you understood what you have to do. So if you understood, then please try to solve the problem by yourself right now don't move forward right okay so let me explain a little that whenever we are solving a pattern based question we have to always focus on how many lines we have to print how many stars or how many digits we have to print at each line and how many spaces are there but here spaces are not important but the number of lines and the number of digits or patterns are important right okay so look at here carefully we for input 4 we have to print 4 lines right okay so for printing 4 lines we have to run a for loop and inside that for loop we have to run another for loop to print the digits right so what we have to do just uh, write a for loop and write another for loop inside that and increment the value of i or the digits and uh, after that just print a line right so I hope you will solve the problem by yourself. Okay, I am not explaining anymore. Okay, let's move forward to the next question. But before we proceed to the next question, I would like to inform you that in these days, all the coding questions are being asked from our materials. So if you want the materials, then please pay 49 rupees at the UPI given in the description box and send me the screenshot at Insta. I will provide you the materials, right? Okay, let's see the questions. So the second question is regarding leap year right so actually you will be given two ranges like uh, from 1900 to 2000 right so you have to print leap years among this range right so i hope you understood what you have to do and i hope you know what is the conditions for a uh, year to be leap year right okay so i hope you will solve the problem by yourself so i hope this information added value to your career so if you want more then please subscribe this channel and watch the playlist regarding accenture and please give the code of those questions in the comment section and don't forget to join our telegram channel in which we'll discuss more right so thank you for today's session